We Fit Wellness, Breaking Blind, underwritten by the Colorado Center for the Blind, Push Beverages, and the United States Association of Blind Athletes. Hey everybody, welcome to Breaking Blind. So today we are doing a really fun activity with our sports and rec division, and we're having it here at the center. And we have some judo champions here that are gonna be doing a judo workshop. And this is my buddy, Steve. He's hey guys. My friend and my coworker, and he's kind of like the judo expert. You know? <laughs> well, uh, judo is a Paralympic sport, and uh, today we have Scott and Heidi Moore with us, and they are, Scott Moore is a visually impaired athlete, and he won the Paralympics in the year 2000 in Sydney. And um, so they're here today, uh, they're going to be doing a judo seminar for everyone here at the center. So It's going to be super fun, so you get some, to see us in some judo action. Absolutely. So, all right. Thank you guys for coming today, Steve, and the Center for Blind for having us out here. I'm really excited to uh, expose you guys to what I think is cool. Alright, so we're going to start. Um, judo is a Japanese martial arts, so we begin and end every class with a bow. The bow is not religious in nature, it's just a welcome to class and thank you for training with me and thank you for teaching me. So if everyone will stand facing me, put your arms at your sides. I'm going to say two things. The first thing is kids gay, which means attention, you'll stand up real straight. And then I'll say ray, which means bow, you bow from the waist, but keep your eyes up. You don't want to look down at the mat because judo players are sleepy. Okay? Ready? Kids get? Great. All right. Judo is the number two practice sport in all of the world. You might know what number one is? Soccer. What is it? Soccer. Soccer. Football. That's right. Football. Soccer, soccer in the U.S. The idea of judo is not about we don't do any punching or kicking. There's no striking. It's all about using your partner's strength against them. Okay? Uh, using momentum and getting them to go where you want them to go against their will. Even better. And we get scores by how they land on the mat. We also do grappling, very similar to wrestling slash jiu-jitsu, and also jiu-jitsu. We also do chokes, if, uh, and that's uh, my wife, it's, that's her specialty. That's why I say I'm sorry every night before I go to bed, uh, because she chokes people. And in the Olympic trials, she chokes the girl unconscious. Um, so let's go ahead and just demonstrate a couple of throws, and then so you can see or hear or feel what, what it's like, and then we'll go ahead and get started. I'll do my favorite, and then... <laughs> Maureen warms up with some arm exercises, crunches, and push ups. Next, she uses a case of Katami pin to pin Steve. They grapple as Steve tries to get free. Steve escaped. Next, Steve throws Maureen and Maureen throws her instructor. <laughs> nice throw. Don't forget to subscribe to Breaking Blind on YouTube. Visit our website, wefitwellness.com. Like us on Facebook, WeFitWellness, and follow us on Twitter at WeFitWellness.